Hello dear friends, almost all videos that are imported to DaVinci need color correction and color grading, especially if the video was filmed raw. For this, go to the color tab. Make sure the nodes tab is active. If not, activate it by clicking on nodes. From this bar, select the video you want. Usually, the first thing I do is create a new node. Nodes in DaVinci are almost similar to layers in Photoshop, but they also do other things. The color settings are stored in this node and we can change or delete it later. Right click in this area, select add node and character. Then drag and drop the node on the right line to add it to the path. You can apply the changes you want using the tools in this part. In these parts, you can enter the number you want or drag them left or right with the mouse. Temp controls the color temperature of the image. By increasing it, the color becomes warmer and by decreasing it, the color becomes colder. By tint, you can adjust the balance between green and magenta. With this tool, you can adjust the contrast of the video. Contrast defines the difference in brightness between bright and dark points in the video. By increasing the amount of contrast, bright areas become brighter and dark areas become darker. With the Mid Detail tool, you can adjust the amount of detail and sharpness of the image. It's better to always choose a number higher than zero for it, because when editing, the quality of the video decreases a little when zoomed, and this tool can improve it a little. Color Boost increases the color saturation, but there is a difference with Saturation tool. Saturation tool increases the color level of the entire video at the same time. But color boost affects more the pale and low saturation points. By increasing it, the color saturation increases appropriately and uniformly. You can control the brightness of shadows and highlights with these two tools. A higher number means more brightness. By using this, you can adjust the color saturation. The number zero means black and white video. By using hue, you can change the color of the video. You can adjust the brightness of shadows, midtones, and highlights with these three wheels. Lift for shadows, gamma for midtones, and gain for highlights. You can also control the overall brightness of the video with this wheel. By clicking on any of these buttons, the settings for that section will be reset. This button resets all settings. By using this button, you can temporarily turn off or on the color and fusion settings. In the end, don't forget that the main goal of this process in video editing is to improve the color quality and bring it closer to reality. So, except in special cases, try not to exaggerate in this field. To go deeper and learn more about this, see the intermediate color adjustment tutorial. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. Goodbye.